I just want to talk about like how I just wanted to like incorporate the gym and stuff into my everyday routine because I made a whole gym routine like a fitness plan I know she because I really really want to start getting into the gym I just love going to the gym anyway because I just love like the after effects it gives me like mentally and physically I love working out and I just love being active during quarantine I used to work out almost every day a little bit last year I would work out here and there but it was never consistent going to the gym and y'all this is my first time going to the gym in literally like months also my first time going to the gym alone i would wake up every day at like 12 to like 3 y'all and it was just really bad like it's not healthy at all and honestly i would get like all my stuff done but just waking up that late every day was not good i would miss like a lot of school i just didn't have energy like my energy was so low y'all i just would feel like bro, like why did i sleep in like i would regret it sleeping in that late i would literally go to sleep at like 5 and then wake up at like 2 shit yesterday i woke up at like four this year i feel like is the time to really get my shit together and also going to the gym not only will be like good for like my mental and physical health it'll be like a stress relief kind of in a way it'll increase my energy levels too y'all i feel like my energy has been like so low just because i'll be sleeping in so much and then like staying up all night and it's like i will still get like my sleep but it's still like it's just not it's not good he said i went on a run because i was like every single time i'm active and stuff i go to sleep like quicker and like better and i get better sleep so i know that going to the gym will literally just like really make me a morning person because then at night i can really actually go to sleep and then wake up and stuff too also with my eating habits as well too because i eat good y'all don't get me wrong i eat really good but I feel like I just eat a lot more and a lot better when I work out. And okay, honestly though, I already know I'm gonna eat a lot more and eat better when I work out because like when I used to work out and I used to uh, do track for a little bit and like volleyball and stuff, I would literally eat so much y'all, eat so much. I remember I gained like 10 pounds in two weeks from doing track. And I feel like if I really just be consistent with my like going to the gym and stuff and just being active, not even just going to the gym like like yesterday how i just went on a run like i could do that i definitely know this is gonna help me to eat better and i mean eat better by eating more not eat like healthier so i just want to talk to y'all about how you know i just feel like the gym will definitely help me with my overall health make me a morning person more and i feel like this year i'm really going to really like start my fitness journey and like really just be in the gym be a gym rat especially with cheer ending as well too because i love going to the gym it's just like you know it's just that discipline that you need you know um y'all my eyelashes i actually like i just i'm taking a lash break if y'all can tell duh but my lashes are literally so long and i'm like so happy because i thought they was not gonna be healthy but they're actually pretty healthy okay y'all so i'm putting on spare vanilla favorite scent and then I'm gonna layer it with, should I just layer it with bear? Yeah, I'm gonna just layer it with bear by Victoria's Secret. Okay, so let's go make breakfast. I feel like breakfast is the most important meal, y'all. I never miss out on breakfast. No matter how late I wake up in the day, I'm always gonna eat breakfast. My mom boiled some eggs, so I might eat some boiled eggs. Oh yeah, don't mind our Christmas decorations. We still gotta look though. We're gonna act like y'all don't see those Christmas decorations. Yeah, so my mom had boiled some eggs. That's a definite one I'm about to eat. My eggs. And then I made some Arabic tea. It is pouring outside, y'all. While I eat, y'all, I'm gonna watch some YouTube. It's 6.47 right now. It really took me like two hours to get ready. I don't know why. It's 6.47 right now. I'm about to watch some YouTube. Uh, I gotta edit these fashion over TikToks real quick. So I can get them sent in. And then I also, I need to do a to-do list for today. Because I got a video that I need to upload today. I need to finish editing that video as well, too. Okay, y'all, so it's 7.44. Girl, I woke up at 5, and it's already, like, 3 hours. I'm about to go ahead and get ready to go to the gym in a little bit. 
I just finished editing these two TikToks. I wrote down my to-do list for today. I just came back from taking the dogs out. It's so cold outside, y'all. It's 35 degrees right now. And it's, like, rainy. Practice? Not practice. We had a game today, but they canceled it because um, of the weather or something. Girl, I don't even know, honestly. I just bought my gym membership because I had to renew it. But I bought the, like, premium one or, like, the, I don't know. What, what the which one? But I'm going to plan it for this because it's just small, easy. I've been there. It's the only gym I really go to anyway. Let me see. So basically, I get like to use like auto equipment. Not auto equipment, but like I get to use like the massage chairs and like all that extra shit. I have never been to the gym this time of like this time of day on a weekday. So I don't know how it's going to look. Like I don't know who's all going to be there. I don't know. It might be empty. I don't know. Um, It's 818 right now. I have this top on from Fashion Nova. And I have some sweats on. And then I just have this jacket just to put on. But this is going to definitely come off. So, I look like a bum right now. <laughs> like, I probably should, like, put on, like, a cute set or something. Work out my chair shoes today because I need to get some workout shoes. So, let's not talk about it. I'm trying to figure out if all I need is my... No, I need to bring the gym bag because I'm not carrying my camera. It's like, the fuck? Should I bring this? Or is this too much? <laughs> this is too much. Bad, oh, I forgot to tell y'all. I also ordered some pre workout as well, and I ordered a water bottle and a planner. Ooh, the start of a fitness journey, and it's crazy. It's like it's not nothing new to me because I used to work out a lot, a lot, especially during quarantine. But going to the gym alone that's something different. I hope it's like nobody in there that I know. Like, it's probably the perfect time to go. Because it's 8.30, everybody's at school. I really don't really have, like, a goal, like, how I want my body to look or, like, if I want to lose weight, gain weight. I mean, I kind of do want to gain a little weight. Right now, at the moment, I'm 126. But that's a good way. The goal right now is just to be consistent, really just for my overall health, so I can sleep better, get a good schedule. And then, like, when I really start getting into gym more, then that's how I can really focus on, like, what my goal is. And I don't even know if I told y'all, but I found my clear glasses while I was cleaning out my room but yeah so basically this is y'all sign and get y'all up and stop being lazy i have never been to the gym around this time so i don't know who is like not who's gonna be there but i don't know how it's gonna look like i'm pretty sure it's gonna be empty i know it's gonna be no kids nobody i know but i want to mind my business you mind your business i don't want to have the mind of it being empty just because of what time it is and then i get in there and it's like packed so you know i'm gonna just Honestly, I just need to shut up and play music. Hey, y'all. So, I'm here. And honestly, it just looks like a whole bunch of old people. But, yeah. I feel like I should walk in there with my glasses. I'm trying to figure out, should I bring my camera in there, y'all? Because, like, I'm really, like, not fucking with, like, bringing my camera in there. It's fine. It's fine. I'm going to bring my camera in there because why are y'all looking at me? Because I have a big-ass bag. Like, leave me alone. But I'm going to see y'all when I get in there. And I hope this car in is not going in there because, which I just slurred. <laughs> First of all, it's cold as f Second of all, I can't even walk. Oh my god. I'm not even gonna lie, y'all. I'm here getting this car for somebody kidding at me. Going to the gym by yourself. Like, well, at least for me, I feel like I go so much harder. And y'all, first, I couldn't really record in there. Well, no, I could. I definitely could have recorded in there. But usually, I go to the one in a different, like, I go to another one, not this one that's closest to me. I go to one that's a little bit farther than me because it's a little bigger. And, like, it's spaces in there where I can record and stuff because in there it's like very small and shit and plus it was my first time going to the gym alone so i just had to i just feel like i needed to just you know concentrate and stuff but yeah that was a different type of workout i did rdl split squats leg press oh my gosh y'all didn't do hip thrusts yeah i went in there thinking it was the other one like i got it mixed up so i went all the way to the back thinking that that's where the stretch room was and the stretch room was right there like yeah that shit is small i need to go to the other one and then i did stairmaster for seven minutes at the end just to you know stretch and stuff and then i stretch at the end too make sure when you work out make sure you stretch afterwards because if you don't stretch afterwards you are going to literally like your muscles are going to tighten up and you're going to be like very 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 sore workout was good i didn't record in there as much but you know i'm still starting out i'm still like you know getting used to going to the gym alone and getting used to going to the gym in general so i didn't want to like just pull a camera out and plus this one definitely wasn't a good place to film at but next time i'll film some more um when i get more comfortable 
comfortable. So workout was good, y'all. I need to go to the bank to withdraw some money. I might grab a smoothie. So and I need to um finish editing this video. So yeah. So let's go ahead and go. Right now it is 10 o'clock. So yeah. I've been up for almost five hours now, y'all. Ooh, you know what I should do? I low-key want to go into Publix because the bank is right next to Publix. I low-key want to go into Publix and grab some fruit. I might actually do that. My legs literally shaking, like shaking. But no, seriously, though, like, I feel actually like, really good, y'all. Mentally, physically, I feel good. And I'm glad I got up at 5 a.m., went to the gym. I'm about to go home, get this video done and edited so I can upload that after practice. I might take a nap before practice. Was she trying to turn? Can I even turn out this way? Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I thought like I was about to throw up. That's how I, I need to stop. I could have gone way longer, but I feel like I was about to go throw up. So it wasn't that bad to the point where I was, like, really about to throw up. But I did feel a little nauseous. Ooh, there's a Target next to me, too. Should I go into Target or should I go into Publix? I think Publix. Because Publix is the one with the good fruit. So. Oh, it can't accept cash. Dispense cash. Hey, y'all. So, the um, drive through ATM didn't do cash. Dispense. Didn't dispense cash. So, I got to go inside. So, yeah. I'm going to see y'all when I get out. I love when money comes out like so clean. I can't even count this shit. This shit's so damn crisp. Like, damn. These are my options, y'all. So, either I was gonna go into Target, Publix, or go get a smoothie, but then I forgot Smoothie King has acai bowls. So, guess what I'm about to go do? Get an acai bowl. You know what I wanna go do? Go into Target and look at the cameras from the day my camera got stolen because I still haven't done it. Uh, it's, it's over with now. I really don't care. I'm curious, but I really don't care. Wait, what if it's like somebody I know like stole it and like they look at my footage and like they seen all my footage? Ugh. That's so weird. Uh. Back up on my bullshit. Back up on the scene. Done dealing with you. Don't know how to deal with me. Done fucking with you. Don't know how to love. So I got a uh, berry goji or whatever the shit called. I don't even know, y'all. Um, strawberries mango coconut flakes and i got honey and my hands are literally like freezing cold this is not something to eat while it's like literally 30 degrees outside yeah i don't even feel like 30 degrees it feel like five degrees so i'm showered i refreshed my hair so it's 11 52 right now um i'm about to just tell y'all how my workout went and because i didn't get to really talk to y'all in the car because i was trying to you know run errands and stuff workout was actually like really really good i'm not gonna lie when i first walked in i felt a little intimidated because i was like it's just a whole bunch of adults i was like literally the only kid in there and it's like i knew what i was doing but like i kind of didn't know what i was doing at the same time because i haven't been to the gym in like forever bro it's literally been so long this is what i did i stretched I ran for like five minutes while well, I walked for four minutes. Like I speed walked for four minutes and ran and sprinted the last one minute. And then I, you know, did my workout. So yeah, I feel like honestly, at first I felt like a little intimidated, not intimidated, not even intimidated. Just, I just felt like a little like, ugh. But you know, once I really just started to work out and stuff and I realized everybody's here just to like do their own thing, you know, then like I was fine. But recording wise, I could not record in there y'all because Usually I go to another one. I don't usually go to that one. So I'm gonna try to go to the other one tomorrow because I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna try to go to the gym every day. Well, at least for like five days out the week. I'm gonna go to the other one tomorrow and then see how that feels. I honestly was thinking about like just not posting this video at all until like the end of the week or until like next week when I really have this down packed. But I feel like posting this will just show y'all like where I started at with my routine and stuff like that because like I just want to look back and and see the progress you know because you know it's my first day like my first real real day going to gym and stuff and I was like might as well why not so I'll update y'all in about like a month or a couple weeks 
I'm keeping this routine. I'm waking up early. I don't have to wake up every day at 5 o'clock. But on the days where I feel like I should, you know, I'm gonna keep the routine and everything. So hopefully y'all enjoying the video so far. Um, hopefully y'all getting a little motivated to get up and, you know, try out a routine because it just betters your life and you get more stuff done. You feel better about yourself, mental health, mentally and physically. And especially going to the gym too. Going to the gym for me right now at this moment technically is not for, I'm not trying to go to the gym to like gain weight or gain muscle. So right now it's just for like my health and for to just get into a routine and then like once I get into that routine once I get used to like really going to the gym then I'm gonna really focus on like my like fitness journey like what my goals are and stuff like that but right now honestly I'm just really trying to just get used to going to the gym um getting into routine and stuff right now i'm about to go to the school and talk to my teachers yeah i'm really proud of myself for getting up today because again y'all i'm literally like i literally go to sleep at five i don't i don't never get up at five so i just felt very proud of myself and i really not even hope i know i'm gonna keep this routine like i feel like this is the year where i really keep this routine and i really stay consistent with it of course you know you're gonna have your bad days you're gonna have your days where you don't want to go and stuff like that and that's fine but as long as you still be consistent and make up those days then you're good so yeah oh i'm gonna see y'all in my next video hopefully y'all enjoyed today's video stay tuned for more videos and yeah so i'll see y'all in my next video bye y'all It's 5.46 right now. I'm done getting ready. I made me a little breakfast. I got everything bagel with some bananas. And if y'all see black stuff in the bananas, it's the everything sees because that should be going everywhere. I decided to just to make this video into waking up at 5 a.m. for a week because I thought to myself, like, I'm going to be doing it anyway. Might as well not record it and then show my progress. And then, like, I'll do one, like in a couple months and then y'all can see like how like I really got used to the routine how like how my progress was and stuff like that so today is Wednesday January 17th and it's 5 47 right now today I woke up actually at 4 45 I woke up to my first alarm which is like very rare and I actually like got up right when I woke up because I feel like number one tip if you are like trying to wake up early and stuff like that tip is to get up right when you're up because if you don't get up right when you're up when you go back to sleep it's done with it like, you're going to be tired for the rest of the day. Like, you're just going to be drained for the rest of the day. Because I'm just deciding to do a 5 a.m. week. Like, I'm waking up at 5 a.m. anyway. So, I was like, might as well just not record it. So, today, I feel a little bit more confident in, like, putting on, like, an actual gym fit. So, um, I have on these leggings from Halera. They're, like, really, really good, y'all. Yeah. And then I have on this top as well from Halera. Yeah, so, right now... I'm about to just watch YouTube, eat my breakfast, and then do my little to-do list for today. I gotta do some laundry and stuff. I wanna do it before I go to the gym so I can, um, like, come home. I gotta edit, do some, like, schoolwork and stuff like that before I gotta go to school at, like, 11.55, 12. So I'm gonna, um, go ahead and write this to-do list, type this to-do list out. And, yeah, and also, I don't know if I told y'all, but y'all know how I ordered pre-workout in a water bottle because I have a water bottle, like I have like a like a water, like a cup, but I want like a water bottle where I can just like throw this shit on the floor and like, you know, pick it up when I you need to drink it. And I also ordered a manual planner. So, you know, I can start actually like writing my stuff down because I really want to start. My hands are dry, so I love my notion, but I feel like if I really write stuff down, I'll remember them more. And I feel like, I just feel like I need to get to that maturity level of writing my shit down. So... Yesterday I posted my how to turn your dreams into reality video. It's just basically in that video I did like a yearly reset. I did a whole bunch of that video y'all. I just talked about how like mindset is like big and how like manifestation and all this stuff like you can literally like like visualize your life and it like literally come to life. Oh also y'all I did a, like a messy bun today. I wasn't actually going to do my hair today like at all. Like I wasn't going to do my edges. I was just going to put a scarf on and like put my hair in a bun. But I just felt like me getting ready would definitely like make me want to like get up and like go to gym and stuff like make me in a better mood so i just ended up actually doing my hair so yeah 
but if y'all already haven't go watch that how to turn your dreams into reality video it's really really good i edited it very 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 good so hopefully y'all are gonna enjoy this little 5 a.m week with me i've never done this kind of video on my channel because i can never commit to it like i never committed to waking up at 5 a.m for a whole week but it's really not that bad y'all okay, so the reason why i didn't go to sleep as early as i should have because i really wanted to be sleep like by eight nine o'clock but i went to sleep at like 11 but i still feel good i got like six hours of sleep i feel i still i'm a little tired of course but you know i feel good like i don't feel like how i usually feel in the morning so i feel like definitely working out um just like being active helped me like to better my sleep and help me to like really want to get up and get this shit do the shit again i just can't wait until like i'm really in the habit where it's like i don't even need to set an alarm i can just wake up and like i'm automatically just getting rid of the gym like with no thought that's when you know you really like got this shit down pat that's when i'm gonna record another waking up at 5 a.m or i'll probably just record like a morning routine or something just to show you my progress i'm probably gonna end no actually i'm not gonna take a nap later because i'm gonna just because i have cheer practice today so i'm just oh and cheer practice y'all okay it's so much but cheer practice got canceled yesterday and i kind of was happy low-key i was ready to go to cheer practice but i was happy because like i just i don't know y'all like honestly cheer um i've been doing it for so long it's like very repetitive now like it's the same thing over and over again and it's like my school we don't do competition all we do is like you know cheers and even this year like we started doing stop and shake that kind of like made it a little better and then like it just got like boring after that so i really haven't been like feeling cheer like that yeah but i mean i'm almost done y'all i got literally like a month for real left of cheer and i'm done and i really can just like focus on myself so like after cheer i'm really just gonna be like at home like i'm really gonna be basically like online and that's what i really wanted because i just feel like i really need to put my time into like other things and even if i do go to school like i don't get the high school experience like my school is not like my school is ass if i'm being completely honest like i like school and stuff like that but i just don't like going to okay y'all so i'm done with my laundry actually i did another load of laundry too just so i can get that out the way like i've been really bad up in my laundry y'all but i finally got them clothes folded and it's seven 57 right now so i'm not gonna go to the gym today and the only reason why is because it's right now it's 14 degrees outside and they're like okay it's cold like not a big deal i'm i'm actually used to the cold like it's not about it being cold it's about like safety reasons because like it's icy outside and stuff and it's like a safety feature that's why school has been canceled in like georgia and then my county hasn't been canceled but yeah and that's why practice has been canceled so my mom was like she didn't really want me to go um to the gym this morning but it worked out perfectly though because today i'm doing abs today is abs and cardio i definitely could do all the workouts i was going to do at the gym here like some workouts i can't do but most of them i can do here so i'm gonna go ahead and start working out because i'm getting a little tired y'all and i just been sitting here doing laundry i'm not trying to fall asleep more like three miles later outside when it gets a little bit warmer because girl i'm not running in 15 degree weather like no i mean honestly though i think i might actually go on a run i kind of do want to go on a run so i'm about to change and stuff like that get warm and stuff and i'm about to go on this run girl please i need some cardio okay and i put on this cute gym kit not for no reason because you know it's okay you could work out at home and still be cute but if i put this bitch back on tomorrow don't mind it okay i can't put a beanie on of course duh because i have a ponytail in so I, I remember i had this so you know i'm gonna just wear this i never wear my apple watch but girl we're gonna wear it today y'all i've charged my small sony camera for the gym i mean i'm not going today but tomorrow i'm gonna get some good footage because i have this smaller camera where i can just put it in my pocket so then i can really put my bag so i put my gym bag in the locker i don't have to worry about like carrying it around so yeah i'm gonna make sure i get my gym content okay this is like this is funny okay let's go all right yeah i got my coat on i couldn't find no gloves but i think i'll be fine let's see how cold it is oh no this is so much better though low-key look look at the car fucking crazy y'all i'm back y'all i already took my layers off i basically just walked like oh yeah i didn't end up running i walked 
my goal is 10 10k steps and i just walked that in, in an hour it's crazy forgot to show y'all what time it was it's also 9 42 but yeah so i'm about to shower and stuff and i'm gonna see y'all probably tomorrow yeah i'm gonna see y'all tomorrow at 5 a.m okay Hey y'all, so I'm ready for the day now. Um, it is, let me show y'all, my phone's over there. It is 6.23 and um, yeah, I don't know why it takes me so long in the morning to get ready. Well, actually I do know why, it's because of my hair. Like, if I had, like, some braids in or something, if I had my hair done, it wouldn't take me that long to get ready. But, yeah, and I just be taking my time because, you know, I'm waking up at 5 a.m. Might as well take my sweet time. Oh, I got to clean off my mascara. I just did my mascara. I got to clean it off. But, so, don't mind that. But I wanted to show y'all my pre-workout came in my water bottle. I used to have this water bottle, but um, I don't know where, where it went, honestly. But, yep, y'all, I'm feeling a little bit better about the gym today. Actually, I felt good about the gym yesterday. It's just... I didn't go, of course, because of the ice. But my run yesterday, not my, I ran and I walked. I didn't record as much because I couldn't. Because, like, if I took my hands out of my pockets, like, my hands were really going like, to freeze off. Like, literally, y'all. Yeah, so at least I did some, like, some kind of workout. Like, if you can't go to the gym or if you just can't, like, um, if you don't feel like working out, like, go on a walk or, like, go on a run or something. Like, girl, everybody was looking at me crazy. Like, what the f*** is you doing walking at in 14 degree weather? But, like, who gives I got a water bottle now. Got this little little time thing on it if y'all want this it'll be in my amazon storefront and then i got this oxy shred pre-workout the reason why i got oxy shred is because that's the one i see everybody using i've been watching a whole bunch of like fitness content and stuff like that just to like you know get back into like researching about it because a long time ago i used to really like want to like start working out wanting to get into the gym and stuff but i was really young i was probably like 14 so yeah but i got raspberry fresh and yeah honestly they said take one scoop in the morning with cold water and then take another scoop 10 minutes before your exercise i'm just gonna take one scoop because technically i don't really need it because y'all honestly for me not to be a morning person i have been waking up like so good like i don't know like i've been like i literally wake up and i'm not even tired like i'd be waking up i'll stay in bed i wake up at like 4 45 i'll stay there for like 15 minutes i don't even go on my phone i actually just turn the tv i just watch tv and just lay there and then i'll get up and like get ready and i won't even be tired and i literally i went to sleep at like almost 12 last night so i got about like five hours of sleep i took a nap yesterday i took like a an hour and a half nap before practice before cheer practice yeah i feel like honestly i feel good like if i just go to sleep at a reasonable time i get my rest i work out you know i eat good like i feel like i could be a morning person and i feel good right now i don't feel tired actually i feel energized i did my hair in this little low pony i'm gonna probably put it in a um most likely in the bun but the reason why i did a low pony when i went to the gym the other day i wanted to put my hood on so bad even though i didn't have a hood because i had that like the um the other jacket on i wanted to put my hood on so bad because i feel like i feel so much better about being in the gym so a little tip if you like you know got a little gym anxiety make sure you go there and you're gonna work out in the hoodie go there with like a hood so you could put it on but i just made now my grits are kind of dry because i was talking to my mom it's fine i made some grits do y'all like y'all grits runny or like clumpy? I, I don't like my grits runny. And then I got my pre-workout drink. Why is it so good? Like literally it tastes like Kool-Aid. I'm only going to take one scoop. Like some people take five scoops in a day. Mm -mm, baby. I'm just going to stick with my little one scoop. My planner had also came in. So I really want to start writing down in here. I'm going to write like, my to-do list and stuff in here now. Instead of, well I'm still going to write my to-do list like on my Notion. But yeah, so that's what I'm about to do while i eat and watch some youtube it's crazy because like this is all starting to like turn into a routine when i first started to do this video it was just like i was just gonna wake up at 5 a.m go to the gym and then see how my routine goes and now it's like it's a routine now like i wake up i get ready i make my food i watch youtube and i write down my to-do list for the day and then i get and then like i get ready to go to the gym i come home from the gym and then i like go to school and go to cheer practice it's like it's like a routine now and it's only been like the third day i, I think i told y'all yesterday but i charged all of my batteries for my small Sony ZV-1. 
so I can really get some good footage in the gym today, y'all. Because this camera is a little bit big. It's actually, it's really big. It's bigger and it's hard to record in the gym. It's so hard, y'all. I'm going to go to the other one today. It's a little bit bigger. So I hope I can get some footage. And I filled up my water bottle. Um, I was lazy. I didn't feel like filling up all uh, with ice. But y'all, it is literally like stuck. Like, am I tripping? I, I don't know. <laughs> before the gym or what i be watching but if none of my favorite youtubers posted to get motivated and to just like look at different workouts and stuff and i'm pretty sure like i have a good idea of like the stuff that i want to do because these target um, exercises that um include like rowing and pulls and things of that sort because it just always feels good for my body so face pulls again we want to make sure that you're engaging your lats as you of course you want to be building up but when you keep it at a weight that you can keep it very close and if i promise you will because you drink your biceps like that's it trying to keep it cute humbly one two sets of eight reps of you say listen we're done the upper body it's seven 22 okay y'all i'm about to go but i wanted to show y'all my little gym fit i have on the leggings from yesterday because i didn't go to the gym and then i have on this long sleeve let me show you how i could this long sleeve from um hilera too and these are from hilera by the way but yep and i have this hoodie and then i have also a cropped uh cropped like hoodie jacket so you know i might work out in that instead so if i get hot because i'd be overheated but yeah i feel good i feel energized i think that people work out i'm a little jittery but you know i'm good though great let's go ahead and leave i need to preheat the car i really need to go to, to the bins dealership so i can set up my app and stuff because i still haven't done that y'all i feel so good like i feel very very productive good like i've been in a slump the past few months honestly y'all and like this this like it's, you just feel so good like when you get it done this doesn't even feel like a task this feels it's like oh i get to go to the gym tomorrow i get to work out like this is fun like i'm not even gonna lie like, i feel like when you do a little shit like to romanticize getting it done you know it feels a lot better but yep mainly i want to do a couple workouts ab workouts like core workouts and definitely cardio of course i always do cardio it's 7 52 right now so i left <laughs> i don't know why i be leaving the house so late like oh and i forgot how to do it y'all i gotta do it first I'm pulling up why I can't crease. I came a long way from the east. Got a bitch, she cooking clean. That shit a lot of the carry a dime. When I'm with you, I get nothing. Mm -hmm. Lose a lot of your friends, and that's what hurt the most. You can't do nothing. I know it might sound lame, but just stand here, y'all. I gotta go pee so bad. I'm already almost done with my water. I'm about to go ahead and walk in there. And yeah, I just hope it's not packed. It looks a little. Uh, it looks a little bad, I ain't gonna lie. But I'm gonna go ahead and start recording on my Sony ZV-1. So I'm gonna see y'all when I get back. Y'all, workout is done. 
yeah, I just left. Now I'm at the beef spot store because I gotta grab some eco and some lashes for my mom. But the workout was good, y'all. My arms are killing me. Actually, I actually did better than I thought for my first day, like back doing like arms and upper body. Workout was good. I did a little bit of abs. The only, okay, to be honest, the only abs I did was that one workout y'all seen. And then I did arms. And yeah, and I did, yeah, I basically just did upper body, honestly. I didn't do too, too much, but I think I did enough because I didn't know how to really work like some of the machines yet. So, you know, we're going to get there. But, yeah, workout was good. I'm about to go ahead and run in here. To be a spot store, grab some ego, and I'm going to go to Chifle to get me some food. Because, oof, I'm hungry, y'all. I am hungry. And then I um I walked for five minutes and sprinted for two minutes. And I started to feel nauseous. So, I was like, yeah, it's time to go. And y'all know I'm on my period. So, yeah. And I don't even know how I'm doing all this in my period. But, girl, God got me, I guess. He could have opened the door. It's five minutes. 10 a.m. Are you dead ass? Five minutes. That should just piss me off. Like, should I wait five minutes or should I just go to Chick-fil-A and then go to Walgreens? Because all I need is eco. Okay, yeah, because that just pissed me off. Welcome. If you have your extra care card, please scan it now. It's just so crazy, like, I don't know, like, I just feel like life has just changed so much, y'all. Like, I'm really growing up, like, I I graduated this year. I... Good morning, what's your name? Good morning, Maya. What can I get for you today? Can I get one Chick-fil-A um, chicken biscuit? And then can you add cheese and bacon on that? And then can I get another chicken biscuit, but a plain one? Um, Would you want more? Yeah. A chicken nugget breakfast burrito meal? Chicken. You want the meal? Yeah. What's the dream? What's the dream one? And then can I get a Coke with that? What else for you? Yeah, can you do jelly and honey? And then can you do um two of those jalapeno salsa? You, know, the cash Have a great day. you too. You. This hoe was laughing at me. Oh shit. Good morning. What's the next Maya. Thank you. You too. She definitely hurt me. She's gonna spam my food. Okay, this is my morning. It's 10 18, so I'll see y'all tomorrow morning. Bye, y'all. Hey y'all, so good morning. It's January 19th. It's Friday and it's the fourth day. I got one more day, which is tomorrow. And usually it would be like Monday through Friday, but I didn't. It was Martin Luther King um, day, Monday. So I started on Tuesday. So I'm just going to end it off on Saturday. But I made me some Eggo waffles. It's just two of them. So I wasn't really like in the mood, in the mood for food. Like my pre workout. That shit tastes so good. That's a raspberry one. And then yesterday I had um, already made my water bottle, put ice in it and everything, and put it in the fridge. And my fridge be freezing stuff. We gotta get a new fridge. But it be freezing stuff. So it's like a little frozen, but you know, that's perfect. So, like, especially like if you lazy in the morning, all you gotta do is take it out and then boom. Yeah, I'm gonna try to leave a little earlier today. I think my mom might come with me. I don't know. I want her to. And she needs to come with me. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna try to leave a little earlier today because I think we have to go to the bank. The bank is like all the way, like in a, it's like 50 minutes away. So I'm gonna see y'all when I'm done eating. Oh, and it's 6:42 by the way. I woke up at five, but I didn't get out of bed until like 5:30. I was just watching YouTube, like just chilling. And then it just be taking me a long time to get ready because my hair. Yeah, I'm gonna see y'all when I'm done eating, and then I get ready to go to the gym. Okay.
good now. It's gonna be up in the next hour. But it's okay though, because I could just redo it. Whew. I'm gonna just bring my skirt. I feel like doing my hair. Well, honestly though, I'm kind of like just doing my hair and stuff just like because I'm recording. But then I thought about it like doing my hair and like putting like some mascara on and stuff. I feel like it helps me to like wake up and it helps me to feel better about going to the gym. Especially like putting like a little cute gym fit on. I have, let me show y'all what I have on. I had already a uh, pre recorded before I put on my clothes on. But I have this long sleeve top from Halera. And like the back is out. It's real cute. I, I put a video. And then these are also from Hilaire. I added a sponsor. I did like a couple sponsorships with them. That's why I have a lot of active clothes from them. But their clothes are really good. So let's go ahead and get this workout done, y'all. Today is leg day, my favorite day. I need to get a hip thrust pad. And funny thing is, is I have one downstairs. But it's like a, a pool noodle that's cut. And I'm not throwing that ghetto ass shit to the gym. But I'm really mainly just going to be using this machine today. Because I've seen how you can do like a lot of workouts with this Smith machine. So RDL split squats, hip thrust. But I'm going to make this workout a little bit uh, quicker. Because we have somewhere to be. So I'm going to try to be back. It's 7.12 right now. I'm going to try to be back before 8.30. It's crazy because I'm really waking up at 5 a.m. And I'm really stuck through with it. I went from waking up at 4 o'clock in the afternoon to waking up at 5 in the morning. Well, really for 4 4.40, 4.50 because I don't be waking up at 5. I be waking up like a little bit before 5 so I can like chill in the bed and stuff. But yes, I'll see y'all when I get in the car. I might have just chugged this. Put in like a scoop in like a little bit of water so I can just chug it down. It's 7.30. I don't know why I be leaving the house so late. I literally wake up at 5. But, you know, I be taking my sweet time. So, it's okay. I could actually, my goal is to leave at 7. So, when I get there, like, the sun will be up. And it'll, like, just be getting up. Hopefully, it's not packed today. It was actually pretty. It wasn't packed yesterday. But it was more people than I thought. Definitely. I looked up when is the, like, least busiest time. So go to the gym. Or I think I said busiest. I don't remember. Least busiest time. They said five to six and then seven to eight. Yeah, so I guess I'll just see how when I get to the gym. I'm feeling pretty good. Yesterday, uh, I had like a little game night or whatever. And I had cheer practice. I was gonna vlog the game night and put it in this video, but the game night, the senior game night definitely was um we're just gonna say like only 12 people showed up and I only knew like three people there yeah. I went to sleep around 12 so I got like about five hours but I took a nap yesterday so it's cool I'm definitely gonna take a nap today because I have a game today and yeah so I'm gonna see y'all when I get to the gym it's gonna be probably like let me actually see how long because it be fluctuating y'all the reason why y'all haven't seen me at school because y'all probably wondering so like why the um, the reason is because I changed all my classes to online and I have one in-person class. We're just trying to get my class to figure out right now, so that's why. Like tops, like short sleeve tops.
Hey y'all, I'm done with my workout. It is 8.56. Um, I think I got in there at like 7.45. Or got here at 7.45. I don't remember. But it was a good workout. And I gotta go because I just hit a car with my door. So... But I'm about to go to, this is one way, I'm about to go to Smoothie King right quick and grab a smoothie. And then I'm going to head home, y'all. This is shit that be having me gain weight, is this smoothie I'm about to get. Shit. Oh my god, y'all, my arms are so sore. I feel like out of everything, my arms are like the sorest, y'all. Okay, but as I was saying, so... This is how I began away, y'all. If y'all drink one of these, like every, maybe every other day. Oh, I love when people be nice and let me go. I get a uh, Caribbean away, which is strawberry banana. And then I get Gladiator Protein, the strawberry one. This shit will have you like gaining, gaining, like on some real shit. Like you'll be gaining weight for this. Hopefully y'all enjoying the video so far. Hopefully y'all getting motivated to get up, you know? Cause if I can do it y'all, I'm telling y'all, if I can get up at 5 a.m. every day, y'all can do it too. Tomorrow I think is core and abs, sadly, and cardio. I'm gonna do a little cardio tomorrow too. But yeah, so I'll see y'all tomorrow morning. Have my bestie with me, y'all, today. Period. Bow, 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 bow. She's coming to work out with me, y'all. I have on this, oh, um, I don't even know what this is, y'all. Honestly, a YS sports bitch. I don't fucking know. Honestly. And then sports bra. I'm probably definitely not going to take my shirt off. But, and I got this oversized t-shirt on. Period. Today, y'all, we're doing, like, kind of, like, full body. I'm not doing no upper body. Like, I can't, y'all. My, my arms are so sore. Like, I just can't do upper body. I can't. Like, I can barely even lift my arms. My legs are actually pretty good. Like, I'm sore, but I'm not, like, my arms are, like, just really sore. Definitely, we're trying to hit abs today, because I haven't been doing abs. Because I skipped it when I went on that hour walk. But it's okay, because I'm getting all that done this week. But today's the last day of the vlog, y'all. Period. It's 5 a.m. vlog. I feel like I did pretty good. Today, actually, I woke up a little late. I woke up around, like, 5.20. I didn't really get on nap yesterday, because, you know, we was running around trying to go to the bank and stuff, and then I had to hurry up and then come back to the school. And they had to come back for me, because I was late and shit. I only got, like, 30-minute nap, like, on the bus, and then a 30-minute nap in the car. But, yeah, so I didn't get on nap. So I'm gonna make sure I get a nap today. Tomorrow is my rest day, and then we start this again Monday. And the video is gonna end after today, so hopefully y'all enjoyed the vlog so far. I'm gonna see y'all when I'm done eating, and we're about to head out. I'm gonna go ahead and chug this down. Um, yeah. Y'all, guess what? She fell down the stairs. Yes, y'all. Like I didn't even want to go this morning. I fell <laughs> up the stairs. That's more embarrassing. <gasps> Wait, my voice? I don't know how the f just did that. Look, <laughs> cars have you a little too smart. Ugh. Like, what? Y'all, I'm ready to work out because mainly because this is my first time in um two, three months that I done had headphones. <laughs> what the fuck? That's a reason? That's, that's yes. great. That's great. Yep, I'm going to see y'all when we get there and we start our workout and stuff. Uh, we're here. It's actually not, well, I came a little bit earlier than I usually come, so it's not too, too bad at all for me. The air is still in place. We still have that wind chill advisory. It's still going to be quite cold. Speaking of wind chill, this afternoon, it's going to feel like teens and 20s. 65-year-old is developing fluids and watering. The same winds are going to be like the ice. I like how it goes from, like, blurry. Okay, never mind. Why is it not getting back focused? I was gonna say I like when it go from like blurry to you know there, so then y'all can see like. Okay, hold on. Let me get this shit focused. Like why? My hair pods. Tell me, y'all. They was in the car. Seven forty-three. Six. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.
Like, one more thing, y'all. If y'all think nobody not talking about y'all at the gym, it's supposed like us. I'm just right. Get the work in, y'all. She did that shit. Yes. I need to record our ab workouts. Y'all, we just did like three ab workouts. I didn't record none of the ab workouts. I know. So that's the end of the video. Your girl really woke up five days straight at 5 a.m. in the morning and went to the gym and started her little fitness journey and everything. Y'all watching this video February something, but this video was filmed three weeks ago. And I've been sticking to it. I've been waking up. I've been going to the gym every day, every weekday. Right now, I'm just gonna reflect on like what helps me wake up at 5 a.m., how it affected me, staying disciplined, because this is all about really like self-discipline. I mean, of course, a lot of people wake up at 5 a.m. like to go to work or to go to school like you really just have to discipline yourself and get get your ass up at this point okay okay so first what helped me waking up early first thing is not snoozing my alarm snoozing your alarm and going back to sleep and then once you go back to sleep you're you're done with like body is gonna automatically shut back down once you get up you're gonna be tired for the rest of the day if you just get up no matter how tired you are if you just get up right when that first alarm goes off if you just get up once you start washing your face brushing your teeth you would literally start being wide awake keeping myself busy waking up at 5 a.m when you wake up and you think to yourself like what am i what am i doing right now once you wash your face uh brush your teeth uh get dressed for the day take a shower make some food it's probably like six six o'clock by then and you would think like dang like what am i gonna do now might as well go back to sleep you know so you just gotta keep yourself busy and the way i kept myself busy obviously was going to the gym definitely life changing yeah i love the gym so much like i love the gym and i'll do like a whole different video on the gym and like fitness journey and stuff another tip on waking up early is going to sleep at a reasonable time you have to go to sleep at least before like 10 11 at the latest and if you go to sleep at 12 you have to have to take a two hour nap before that or you're literally going to be like so exhausted and so tired in the morning and you don't want that because sleep is definitely the most important thing and you just want to get some good sleep go to sleep at a reasonable time and you'll be good to wake up at 5 a.m i pack my gym bag at night i pick out my gym clothes at night make sure my room is clean at night fill my water bottle up and put it in the fridge and i just set myself up to wake up early and to only have to really just wash my face brush my teeth like do my regular morning routine stuff and then i have all this stuff laid out have water by your bed so you don't have to get up and get some water just have it all laid out so when you really get up like you really don't have to do all this stuff when you get up you know and especially because it's early as in the morning you're not gonna be one in the mood to do all this stuff when you get up it's just gonna feel so much better like, so that's like my main tips on waking up early and what helped me to wake up early throughout this week and throughout the couple weeks that i have been waking up early from now a year from now that's like what i really would probably talk about my fitness journey and all that stuff i did want to reflect on like how it was going to the gym for the first time alone and honestly going to the gym with somebody and going alone is very very different i say definitely if it's your first time go with somebody like if it's your very 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 first time stepping in the gym go with somebody like it will make it 10 times better because if you go alone like girl that shit is a little, little bit hard it's a little bit intimidating but just go with somebody first tip like, don't go to the gym clueless like you gotta research like you gotta look up workouts look up how to use machines no matter like it depends on like what kind of gym you're going to mainly every gym kind of has the same machine so it makes you look stuff up look up workouts plan out your workout before you go to the gym too like if it's leg day plan out what workouts you're gonna do so when you get to the gym you know you can already have it laid out and with gym anxiety you gotta understand that everybody is going to the gym for a reason to get a workout in they're not worried about you they're not worried about how you look if you're really struggling with a machine if anything somebody would probably just come up and help you like it's really not that bad i had gym anxiety going to my first time because it was just like the first time going alone you gotta understand like these people are here for the same thing you're here for so you just gotta really just get out your head honestly and if it's your first time going to the gym whether that's with somebody or alone you gotta understand that everybody in that gym has had a first time experience in the gym so you gotta understand like everybody's been through the same thing that you're about to go through you gotta stop thinking about what other people gonna think about you for real. you gotta time manage your morning as well too like when i woke up i would wake up like this is my morning routine like i have my morning routine so down packed now it's just like it's crazy to do list is your biggest friend girl because with to do list you can really just lay out everything that you need to do throughout the day 
and you can check it off and get it done and you'll feel so much better once it's checked off i just want to say that definitely like i never would have thought that i would have gotten to this um stage in life uh of me waking up at 5 a.m and going to the gym which is kind of crazy i am not a morning person like at all it's so bad like, it was so bad but now sleeping in for me is nine o'clock so i just say like just self-discipline is the biggest thing and mindset as well too you just gotta have the right mindset and have self-discipline so hope y'all enjoyed today's 5 a.m vlog which is crazy i would never thought i would actually film this like when it was trending during quarantine i tried it and i feel like the second day but anyways hope y'all enjoyed today's video i will see y'all in my next video but yeah, and don't forget to go check out this video, okay?